the toy forever? Oh yeah. no, hold on, oh, wait, it's Mom, started. it's me, it's me. Excuse me? You and the toy forever came from Deborah Eternity, honey. Okay, you need to just step aside for a little bit. Let me just get the ball rolling. Start your own channel. Lights, camera. Start your own channel. She gets, she gets so excited when the camera turns on. <laughs> hey, hunties, it's your girl, the Toy Forever, back at it with another video. Yeah. I'm here with my beautiful mother. Ah, yes, Miss Deborah in the house, in the kitchen, ready to work up a pot for you today. Yes, so the other day on my Instagram, I asked you, what kind of content would you like to see more of? And so many hunties and honkles were like, Latoya, your mom needs to get her butt in the kitchen and chef it up. So that's what we're about to do today. Let everybody know what you are cooking today, mama. So today I'm throwing down a roasted jerk chicken. My favorite. You don't have to go to the island. We're bringing the island straight to you, honey. Straight to the Woo! egg, okay? <laughs> so let's get started. Are y'all ready for this bomb? -ness that's about to happen She's up in this kitchen. Bomb. I hope you are. Bomb. We will leave the recipe and everything in the description yes. box below so yes. you can try it at home because let me yes. tell you, it's about to be mm, delicious, honey. Lit. Down to the marrow and now sucking on them bones. Oh my gosh. So All right, let, let, let's get into this video. Yeah, let's get into it right now. Okay, y'all. So on today's menu, we are making some roast jerk chicken. We're also gonna make some steam rice and some plantain on the side mm, because plantain so good. is my favorite. Wait. Yes. When I was young, I did not like fried plantain, but now it's like so good, it's so sweet, so and I delicious. love busting it with a Caribbean dish, yes. always. Yes, and for us healthy folks, now that I'm halfway there, um, <laughs> I prefer to boil the plantain rather than fry it. Fry, mommy! Like a fried fillet to have oleo and oleo. Yes, maybe yes. we can do half and half. Yeah. And my mom's also gonna throw in some potato yes. in the roast jerk chicken. Yes. So we are gonna start with seasoning the jerk the chicken. chicken. Okay, so let's put everything aside and season. Now, mind you, y'all, we don't measure around here. We just sprinkle, sprinkle, dab, dab, pinch, pinch, pinch and all kind of tea. And all kind of tea. And all right, just boss, 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 yes. boss. All right. So let's get all the ingredients. Yeah. Oh. Yes. This is not your average cooking show. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited. We even have our galaxies in it and everything. Everything and everything. Everything is everything. Handies and hunkos. So now we're here at prep time, seasoning the meat time, the whole chicken, right? So I'm gonna use some jerk marinated seasoning here and some jerk powder seasoning as well because I like it to be real juicy and sweet so it tastes so good. Some organic black pepper, there you go. And some garlic powder as well. And I have some organic adobo seasoning here. It just has a variation of different seasonings in it and it just tastes really good. I have fish and meat sauce here. I'm gonna put a little bit of that in there. Some thyme, oil, yeah. And then we have the fresh seasonings. This is my favorite. The onion, the garlic, green onion, a little bit of scotch one and pepper, because we have children here, so I have to be careful with that. And also red peppers. So I can't wait! I'm gonna season up so nice for you guys. I'm excited. It's so extra! Yeah. What about the lime, mom? Yeah, the lime I'm using to wash the chicken with first before I season it. So that's what I'm gonna do with the lime. So I'm squeezing the lime on the chicken. Okay, and I'm gonna rub it up all over. So why do you squeeze lime on the chicken, mom? Because it takes off slime. It just breaks, you know, the freshness of the chicken and thing. You wanna just really get it. It smells so good. Doesn't it smell good? It smells really it smells good. good. And another thing that we do is we wash our chicken with vinegar yes, as well. Yes. So mm. just take away that fresh scent. Yeah, you know? all the like, there's and a little, little extra little, layer of skin yeah, on the chicken. You wanna get all goes. that off? You yeah. Know? So we got that all off. So we're about to season up the whole chicken right now. So I'm gonna start with the jerk seasoning. Here we go. Oh, I'm so excited. Yes. Make sure to wash all your hands quarantine, right? Wash all your hands, <laughs> corona, wash it. Just make sure you guys coat the chicken. Yeah, go inside the Bamsi area here. Yeah. yeah. Make sure you get inside there. Is it called the canal? Your canal, yeah. Yes. Canal, yeah. The Bamsi. I see the Bamsi. But we're too much because we have a lot of seasoning happening, but there's a lot of flavors and it's gonna taste so good. My mouth is watering right now. Okay, so we're gonna get the garlic powder. Okay, so here we go. Mom's extra, okay? <laughs> yeah, she's extra. I'm excited. Okay. Just coat the chicken, y'all. Yeah, it's not it that serious. You don't need to measure, just coat no it. Don't measure nothing. 
you know, shake it up on it and ding. Just chicken waiting for doing. that. Chicken waiting for that. Yep. Okay, the adobe, organic seasoning. You don't have to be organic, but I yeah, it's like, all purpose. Yeah. Yep. All purpose. Yeah. Get in there. Oh. I'm gonna be busting up some holes in there too. And so get it right in there, nice under the arm and thing. <laughs> <Ready next day. laughs> All right, so here is the black pepper. Okay, you know jerk seasoning have plenty of black pepper and thing in it. There we go. We're gonna use the rest of the time that's left in the bottle. Oh gosh, this one tastes so delish. So now I'm gonna use my fish and meat sauce. Just a little bit of dab there, you know, rub it in. Just a little bit of, a few drops, right? Rub it in and get ready for the Himalayan salt. That's why it's like I'm using that salt now. So I'm gonna get a little teaspoon. And I'm gonna just put the teaspoon in the bag. And just like not, don't even put a teaspoon, just a little pinch like that. All right? Is like that a, a pinch, little, mom? Like a little more than a pinch. <laughs> like that. Okay. And then I just like to kind of like just put it on the, the skin of the chicken and rub it in. Okay. You know? Rub it in. And then, of course, you have the jerk smearinating sauce. Come oh, on. I love this. Come in Dongi Road. Yes. Except my hand all up in she belly and thing on she breast and thing. So you just grab a spoon, a teaspoon. I take like two, one here, and the next one. I like to rub it up. Okay, nice so in two. There. Yeah, two. Rub it up. Oh gosh. Wait till this is the, I take some of my hand and I push it up. Underneath the, the skin. Area. Yeah, underneath the skin. Yeah. I'm gonna lift that part. You know, right there like that. And I turn she around, rub on she bam bam. Isn't that precious? Look at that. All right, so the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna spray the roast pan with some pan. Roast pan with some pan. pan. Roast pan Miss with the pan. pan. Okay. And that's so that the chicken skin won't stick to the bottom of the roast that's pan. Good enough. That's fine, yep. That's great. My one job, okay. Put some onion inside. Okay. Garlic. How much onion did you put in, Mom? Like, not even a half of an onion, like half of and half of an onion. Okay, so okay. half and a half, so a half quarter. of a half. Yeah, a quarter, quarter of an a onion. A quarter onion. Yeah, put inside the bam area. Okay. I put four cloves of our whole garlic. Okay, four yeah. cloves. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 that. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Then I have some green onion. This is two green onions here. Okay. I'm not gonna put the whole thing. Okay. Just gonna put it on top. Yes, yeah. Lord. Mm -hmm. Sprinkle that green onion on top. Give it some flavor. Okay. And then I like to use red pepper for color. Mom loves red pepper. Mm -hmm. Even mm -hmm. in your curry chicken, you love I red love pepper. pepper. You taught me that. I love it. It's so, so good. good. More veggie. Yeah. And then sometimes we do put um, scotch bottom pepper, but because yeah. the kids also yes. eat it. You have to be very careful. And we got mild jerk seasoning, so yeah, it's not it's too not the spicy. spicy one, yeah. So they're able to eat as well yeah. and enjoy their meal. Take the chicken, right? Season okay. up nice and juicy and then I put it inside the right. pan. We're giving you a step it pop. by step. Are y'all following us? Follow us. Peter. Follow us, follow us. Here we go. Make sure you like this video like right now if you want to see more cooking videos with my mom. Let's get this video to 10,000 likes and we will produce more cooking videos for our hunties. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And as the chicken is roasting in the oven, I'm gonna teach my mom one of my favorite dances, my favorite TikTok dances, is the Savage Challenge by um, Meg Thee Stallion. She didn't make up the dance, but the dance went viral, and I'm obsessed. So, are you ready to learn TikTok, Mom? I guess. I'll learn TikTok. You better learn it. Let me go wash my hands. Okay. And then I'm gonna put the chicken in the oven. After I marinated the chicken, season up real good, rub it up real nice and sweet. I'm gonna take the pan over to the oven and stick it in there at 350 degrees. And uncover. Uncover. Right. Then we're gonna just watch how it fits in the Good job, Ma. Woo! Okay guys, so the chicken is in the oven, roasting up on 350, uncovered. We're gonna leave that in the oven for about what? 45, 45 minutes? minutes? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
We're gonna check it every so often, turn it and do all that jazz. Mm -hmm. Mommy forgot to poke holes in it, but that's okay. Yeah, it's okay. I forgot to poke holes in it. It's a real thing. It's a real thing. Ask Annie Julie. All right. Okay, <laughs> so right now I'm gonna teach my mom a savage challenge and my sister is in the background and she is going to sing the lyrics because we don't wanna get no copyright infringement out here in the world. First move is the wall, right? Yeah. Okay. I'm a savage. Okay, I'm a savage and you clap, round clap. I'm a, I'm a savage. savage. All right. Oops. Classy, bougie, ratchet. Okay, you got that? Yeah. So, classy, bougie, ratchet. All right. Sassy, sassy, moody. Okay, so sassy, sassy moody, moody, nasty. Okay, mom, you have to throw it back. Oh gosh, okay, how do you do it again? Okay, nasty. Okay, I need to like you're rolling it. Like nasty. Okay. No. You have five kids. Roll you should know about this. Acting, Acting stupid, stupid. What's, what's happening? happening. Shake, 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 what's, what's happening? Blah, blah, blah. I'm, I'm a savage. savage. Mm. You got it, Mom? Mm. I think you're good. Okay. All right, we okay. actually practiced a little bit before. Yeah. But. <laughs> okay. Ready? Yeah. One, two, two. One, two three. I'm, I'm a savage. savage. Classy, bougie, ratchet. Mm. Sassy, moody, oh, nasty. I, okay, hold on. <laughs> Mommy! One, two, three. I'm a savage. Uh, classy, bougie, ratchet. Yeah. Sassy, moody, nasty. Acting stupid. What's happening? What's happening? I'm a savage. Yes, Mom! Yes, Mom! <laughs> So, so I've had the chicken roast in the oven now for 30 minutes and I see it's big juice and thing there. If you don't have juice in the bottom, then you can always add some, just boil some water in the kettle and just pour it in there. And then you coat the chicken with the juice from the bottom. Yes. I take some juice and I just yeah, coat the chicken. Mm -hmm. And then after we're gonna put some more jerk chicken marinade on it. Yes. To make it real juicy. Still and have to cook it, it to do, yeah. Yeah. Okay. But okay. it feels so good. It looks so, so good. good. And I love when it's nice and brown. Brown and thing. So I'm gonna take the next tablespoon of jerk season and just rub it up on it, base it like. Yeah. To give it some nice flavor. Now we're gonna keep that in there for about what about 20 minutes? Yeah, 20 to 25. You just depend, have to depend, it, yeah, no? depending on how big your chicken is, how much pong it weigh. Mm -hmm. And thing, so you leave it this so rub it up, and I get the little rub up thing, and I just rub up yeah, little rub up thing, and I spread it all about. And then, smelling so nice and good, oh gosh! Ooh. We're getting ready to fry some plantains. Yeah, I'm a savage. Wow. Anyways, we are about to fry some plantain, you guys. Yes. So I cut the plantain in half diagonally like this. <laughs> like this and like this. Like, like this. That so like, like this. that. Like that, right? So I cut the plant in half. In but half. But on an angle. On an angle. I like it to look pretty, pretty, pretty. Right. So I go like that. One half and I slice. Be very careful with your sharp knife, right? You kind of just go into it a little bit like that. Right? Right. Okay. And then you take your finger, you go inside, and you start to peel it off like that. Nice. You see? You yeah. just go in like that. Do another one like that, come down here very gently, and then you just take your finger and you go in there like that. I is learning. Good girl. Yeah. She's learning. And then I what slice I do, it. slice it. So I just put it on the board. Not too big, you know, like I guess. And then I put them in a bowl like that. We have two whole plantains in the bowl now cut up, right? So I always take a little pinch of salt and put it on there. I'm gonna take two pinches this time for each plantain. So I'm gonna use a spoon, because I have a bag here, the Himalayan salt, the sink, the pink salt. Very good for you. So a pinch. This is like two pinches in one. Okay, and then I just shake it around like that. So the salt hits everywhere. And then you can use your spoon to salt hits each of the plantains that's in the bowl. All right, isn't that pretty? Look how pretty that is. So I put the two pinches of salt inside the plantain and I'm gonna use vegetable oil 
in the pot. Put your stove on medium, okay guys? On medium. All right, let's put it on medium. And I put the oil in there. I cover up the entire bottom of the pot. That's what I do, like that. No bottom of the pot should be exposed, right? And a little bit of oil on top, you know, just for, so that the, the plantain's frying really good and deep fried into the oil, okay? So I'm gonna wait for the pot to heat up a little bit. So give it like about maybe two to five minutes. So we're gonna take your plantain and we're gonna put the plantain in the hot oil. Just like that, yes. it's not splashing up. Be careful for the splashes of oil. You don't wanna get burned. I've been burned so many times. Some people like more salt. I don't like too much salt, you know? Um, especially when the plant is nice and sweet. But you just wanna pack it all in there like that and just let it bubble up until you're ready for your next batch. Okay guys, isn't that wonderful? Did okay, so back to the roast chicken. It's been about 40 minutes. So what Look my mom likes to that. do is she likes to remove the roast chicken and cut it in half. So she's just gonna go ahead and remove it. Okay. Take some of the sauce and you just marinate it, like just cover it up, base it. They call it basing it, yeah. And what's the point of basing it? Just to lock in juices, you know, make the Skin tastes really nice and juicy and just, you know, well now we're gonna split it in half right down here by the breast. We're gonna split it in half, okay guys? And just cut like that. See how easy that cuts on the middle? Well, we've got some more in there. Like that. And you kinda just open it up like that. Okay. okay. Yeah. And then I'm gonna put some more juice in there. Put my glove on. Okay. Inside. Back into the oven, guys. So it's bubbling up so nice. Yep. Mom just flipping them over. Yeah. Look at that. Flipping them over. See? Like that. And sometimes you can add a little, like, little plantain chips. It's not like a really soft plantain, so. Okay, let's bubble up some more. So I'm so excited. The meal's almost completed. The rice is in about 20 minutes to cook. So I'm measuring two cups. I finally got a measuring cup. Okay, two cups of rice. I'm gonna pour it in the rice cooker. I use the rice cooker to cook my rice. If I'm making rice in peas, I do it in the oven and I use a Dutch pot. We'll do that one later. So I'm gonna do four cups of rice. You changed your mind. Yeah. Put it in there. And guess what guys, I washed my rice three times. Get all the starch out, wash it three times. So that's what it looks like. So I'm gonna go wash it. Okay, so right now we are steaming some jasmine rice. So this is the jasmine rice that we use. Prime grade Thai Hom Mali jasmine rice. Did I say that correctly? Anyways, it's GMO free, gluten free, cholesterol free. free. Women's Choice Award. Women's Choice Award. Yeah. Nine out of 10 customer recommended Jasmine Rose. Woo! Golden star. Oh my gosh, we are finally complete. It smells so good. So it looks good. so good. Yes, I can't wait to dig in. I'm excited to Me eat. Too. Thank Me you too. so much, Mom, for joining yes! me on my channel and yes! teaching everyone how to make your famous roast jerk chicken thank you all for having me dish. more to come more to come more dishes make sure delicious dishes what would you like to see my mom cook next make sure you comment below please comment but right below. now i just want to take a bite to yes. let them know how yummy it is oh my goodness this oh is oh my gosh yes. oh my gosh Ooh, i'm gonna put some gravy on my rice mm. so good oh my gosh and some plantain on the side. I'm just gonna eat a small portion right now because it's like after you cook, yeah. do you really feel like eating? Not like right that? away. Not right you wanna away. give it some time it to marinate and just yeah. sit for a little bit. Anyways, oh yeah. sorry, it's okay. Mm. Mom. Yes. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mom. Yeah, perfect. Mm -hmm. Perfect. That, yeah. The taste is so delicious. It's not too spicy. If y'all want to taste this, y'all have to make mm. it, okay? And when you do, make sure you tag mm. us. 
and let us know how good it is. Mm -hmm. Anyway, subscribe to my channel. And I'll see, see you, you in the next video.